Never tell the truth if it will get you in trouble. Just be honest. Did you do it? If you lie to me, I'll get mad and slap you. But if you tell me the truth, I won't beat you. So answer me. Did you do it? Yes or no? Pause. That was a lie right there. So you keep on lying and see if you get yourself out of trouble. They only want you to tell the truth so that they can slap you without assuming. And don't give into the angelic look in their eyes because you got to remember, even the devil was an angel once. So keep doing what you're doing to see if you get yourself out of trouble. If you tell them the truth, it might go a little bit like this. Yes, it was me. <laughs> I knew it was you. <laughs> you said you weren't going to slap me if I told the truth. I'm like, shut up your mouth, you dim-witted donkey. Always stay quiet while you're getting yelled at. Why did you talk back to me? Huh? Do I look like your mates? Pause. Mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. They're not really looking for an answer to their question. They're just yelling at you. So just stay quiet until they tell you to get out of their sight or something. If you give them an answer, it might just go a little bit like this. No. Shut up your mouth. Who told you to talk you troublesome around you lie? Wake yourself up before your parent wakes you up. Didn't I tell you? Oh, he's sleeping. Hey, wake up. I beg, wake up, my friend. I don't have time for games. <laughs> Paul, get up. Pause. Did you hear that sound? That means that they're not on game time, and whatever they want you to do, they want you to do it now, now. So you better wake yourself up before they wake you up. If you keep fake sleeping, the situation might just go like this. Wake your ass <laughs> up! <laughs> what? Go and wash your dishes that I told you to wash three hours ago. Sleepy sea monkey. If you ask a question and get no answer, walk away. Daddy, can I go outside? Pause. That face, you see that face right there? That's a no, so don't stay and wait for them to answer their question. If they're quiet and they just look at you like this, leave. If you stay, it might go a little bit like this. Why are you still standing there now? I beg, get out of my sight! <laughs> If you know your parents will complain about your music, then turn it down. I'm bad, I really run with her. Started tweaking, had to call a nigga, told her come get her. Swallow with my kids. Ah, pause. When you hear your parents coming to your room while you're playing music loudly, you better turn that music off fast, and there's no time for second guessing. And when you turn that music off, you better be faster than a bullet. Phew. Ah, why is this boy playing music so loudly? Ba ba ba. Eh? Ah, y'all listening to gospel music. I'm surprised. Yeah, I always listen to gospel music. Ah, I didn't know. <laughs> Keep it up. Hey, hey, we finally got something right. Hey, I caught you. You tried to trick me into thinking that you were listening to gospel music. No, I just changed the Shut up your mouth, you deceiving devil. Oh, and I forgot to add, after they leave your room, don't turn your music back on for another good 30 seconds because they might be outside of your door plotting for some reason. If you turn your music back on immediately, the situation would have went like... I served these bars, could have sworn I had a trunk, nigga. Slowly swerve, sip a soda, slightly sober, switching on another tongue, twisting my shit, pop like a thumb blister. Short nigga with a bad temper, I'm on moves like a hand chest, I get away with your staff member, I'm cooking up.